with forward pay from Appalachian Wireless, you'll avoid contracts and credit checks while taking advantage of some awesome perks, like unlimited talk, text, and three gigs of data for just $44.99, or with five gigs for a mere $59.99. Forward pay. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Mingo and Pike counties are rich in heritage, especially when it comes to the Hatfield and McCoy feud and coal mining. A new museum will open tomorrow in downtown Williamson that focuses on just that, our history. The Hatfield-McCoy Country Museum will have something that no one else in the world offers. One of the great things and one of the things I was really trying to do with this museum is provide some one-of-a-kind artifacts that you can't find anywhere else in the world. So if you're interested in this history, you have to come here to our area to learn about it and see these things. Almost all of the artifacts on display are from right here in the region and will have items from both Mingo and Pike counties. A number of the items that we have were, were donated. There's a very large collection of coal mining items that were donated. Also, a number of things that I've gathered over the years that are Hatfield McCoy related and then some things that people have loaned. The Hatfield McCoy Country Museum is located in the former Williamson High School building, which now houses the Ambassador Christian Academy. The museum will have several different rooms to explore. Primarily we're doing coal in Hatfield McCoy right now. We have the interior of a uh, coal camp house from the 1920s. We have a theater that looks like the inside of an underground coal mine. We have the cabin that has a lot of our one-of-a-kind artifacts in it. We've got a number of coal displays. It's sort of a really broad way of telling the story of our region's history. The Hatfield McCoy Country Museum will host a grand opening tomorrow at 2 p.m. After that, the museum will be open Wednesday through Saturday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. with an admission fee. Reporting in Williamson for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.